what we're using here is an ace bandage, a special sort of bandage that you can get for support, which has a stretch in it. We use these to provide comfort um, and they also give the dog awareness of their body. And if the dog is um, imbalanced or is uh, not very well coordinated, it can be a very helpful thing to, to use to give them a little bit more uh, awareness. So if he was just introducing it for the first time, I might just let him sniff it. He's not really interested in sniffing it. Um, I might uh, offer him a treat on it. And then I would just do some touches, do some circles over his body with it, just to get him familiar with the feel of the material on his body. We'll unfold it and we just take it so that we get the center of the rack and we might just rest it over his back to start with so that he again feels it over him um, and see how that goes and if that's okay we'll then take the middle of it and just pass it across his chest so you're taking the middle of your wrap across the chest and then you're crossing across over the back of, of your dog and you're wanting to take it underneath the body so we might just start by just leaving it hanging there and seeing how he feels about that. He's okay with that. Um, and then we take it underneath the body and cross it under the tummy and we'll bring it up over the body. Now this wrap is quite small for Moriarty, but um, we've just about done it. If I use a pin, we can use a pin to tie it, to, to um, fix it or if your dog's a bit uh, smaller, then you can tie it off. But make sure that the tie or the pin is off the spine so it's not right on his back. And that is a half wrap. So it goes the center of the wrap across the chest, cross over the back, come underneath the body, and then bring it back up and tie it off just off center. So to recap, step one, let the dog sniff the wrap or offer a treat on the wrap. Step two, touch the dog with the wrap or lay it over them to get them used to the feel of the material. Step three, lay the wrap loosely around the dog. Step four, complete the wrap. You can do the full half wrap as in the video or as in this picture, a quarter wrap where you just wrap round in a figure of eight. An alternative to the wrap is a thunder shirt and this is particularly useful in those situations where you can't supervise your dog because you should never leave a dog unattended in a wrap. So you can use the Thunder shirt if you have to leave the dog, on walks, in the car, and so on. And it can be a very effective way to help a dog feel more secure.